This report is brought to you by Paramount Pictures. It's time to show them we are more than meets the eye. The Transformers are back. In fact, they're taking us back. All the way back to how Optimus Prime and Megatron first started. Transformers 1 is packed with action. We're under attack! Humor! Look, that's Starscream and your shockwave and sound wave. Enough! Gosh, raise your hand if wave is in your name. There's a lot of waves. And stunning animation. It also packs some pretty big surprises. For thousands of years, we have been at war. But before, we were enemies. We were like brothers. That's right, Optimus Prime and Megatron were once best friends. You ready? Always ready. Let's punch in. In those early days on the planet Cybertron, Optimus was called Orion Pax, and Megatron was D-16. <laughs> Allow me. I appreciate you having my back. No matter what. But things changed. Maybe it's just me, but he's different. Yeah, yeah, no, I picked up on that. Orion is voiced by Chris Hemsworth. This world has secrets you can't even imagine. This is the character before he becomes Optimus Prime, so it did have to have a different vocal quality and different rhythm to it. If we did have cogs, I'd transform into a shovel and beat you. With Megatron, I wanted to have a Megatron that's not just a bad guy the whole time. Obviously, he needs to be friends with the Ryan, so it was important to get somebody who could play the evil stuff, but then could also go the complete opposite way and play somebody who's extremely likable, and um, all of those are Brian Tyree Henry. He is all of that. I can't believe we get to watch from the starting line the best seats in the house. Why'd you bring jetpacks? Alita One is voiced by Scarlett Johansson. How much Energon have you mined under my leadership? So much, Alita One! I think she's a character that has a lot of integrity. She's a born leader. She's kind of a type A personality who is a little bit of a control freak. Um, so not sure why Josh Cooley reached out to me. I told you to evacuate. I did, eventually. If I get fired because of you. Oh, please, they're not gonna fire you. Alita One, you're fired. What? Just based on the personality of Alita, the attitude, the strength, the self-belief, uh, Scarlet was always our first choice. You will explain everything that's happened using words that reflect me in a very positive light. Got it? Yeah, okay, deal. So this movie takes place before anything we've ever seen in Transformers and get to see what life was like on Cybertron before it died and it fell apart and before the war on Cybertron. The animation style is absolutely insane. It's beautiful. The texture of the images is so complex. It doesn't look animated. I mean, it does and it doesn't at the same time. They really created something that feels completely unique to this Transformers. I mean, it's incredible. Like, if I were a kid watching this, I don't know. I'd literally be drooling and, like, losing my mind because it's just so detailed and so real. The visuals were stunning, the colors, the tones, the detail just felt fresh and unique and exciting. It doesn't feel like something we've seen before, and, I, and that's really hard to do. This movie is not makeable as a live action film. It would be 500 million, six, who knows? It would be so much money that nobody would make it. So you had no choice but to do it as animation. But the great thing about doing it as animation is it gave us a lot of opportunity to do things that only animation could do. If we survive this, I'm gonna kill you! I Accept those terms. It was the intention to make this film feel as if it is real without looking like it is real. It's a whole different look that you've never seen before. And you can see it right now on digital. Transformers 1 will also be available starting December 17th on 4K Ultra HD, Blu-ray, and DVD. And the digital and 4K releases come with fascinating bonus content including behind-the-scenes features and interviews with the cast and crew. Decepticons! Rise up and come in! Yeah! Come on! Yeah! Awesome! That's what I'm talking about! Now is the time for us to stand up together as one. For Teen Kids News, I'm George.